Hey guys, it's Jake. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a vintage slash acid wash effect in Adobe Illustrator. So you go to Google uh, or the URL browser and you go to vecteezy.com. I use this website all the time for my YouTube videos and for little effects for designs and stuff. As you can see, I've already looked up a lot of stuff. You can get vectors, pictures, uh, videos on here. But we're going to look up, um, it's actually this thing, but what I looked up was, I think it was fog, and it was this guy. So I was thinking, what is an acid wash vintage effect for like on clothing? It's like a cloud, it's like fog, it's wispy. So I plugged in those words, and I found this uh, file. So I downloaded it opened up the folder. The EPS is like another openable file for Adobe Illustrator. And you get this thing. Uh, there's a lot of there's a lot of anchor points in this wispy effect. So I have a pretty nice, you know, MacBook and it's still pretty taxing. So I'm going to release the clipping mask and get rid of this box. So now I have this it's a bunch of different types of wisps, but I'm gonna focus on this big guy right here. See, it's like a bunch of different anchor points, and I'm not really sure what they're doing, but I don't really care, as long as it looks like this. So I'm gonna bring it over here. I'm gonna to go to my mock-up pack. And take a hoodie. And let's make this, uh, make this black so we're gonna do like an off black color I think that's good if you hear a whirring in the back it's my Mac cuz I'm running audition and illustrator and screen recording and this fucking cloud on my screen so let's get away from that white artboard I don't like that so make sure this fog thing is uh, on top of you know, a, a layered above your garment or whatever, couch cushion or whatever the fuck you're adding acid wash to. Arrange it, bring to front, so it's in front. We can shrink this. I don't wanna change the size of the hoodie because the strokes, the stroke weight will be the same and it might um, mess up the, the proportions of it. So let's put this, uh, let's mess with the dimensions a bit. Let's do vertically. So you can go to transparency and then lower this even more so we can do 40 even. No, that didn't work. We can do 40, so it's very light. So let's copy this. Let's bring this one higher up to get the hood in it. And then put this down here. Yeah. So then we get our pen tool, press P, and we're gonna draw a shape around this entire hoodie. So we select our new shape we just drew and the two fog shapes, make clipping mask, and there you go. It does, you know, lag a lot, a fair amount, I'll say. So it really depends on, you know, what computer you have. And maybe there is an easier way to make an acid wash vintage effect uh, on clothing. Uh, I don't know how to do that yet. I just found this out, I wanna share it with you guys, uh, but this is one place to start. So I hope you find this useful. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my brands and check out my digital assets. Uh, see ya.